Good morning, it's Steve Free in Chicago with the Morning Grain Comments. Well, happy Friday to everybody and hope everybody has a safe and uh, nice weekend. As far as the grains overnight, kind of a mixed trade with uh, soybeans now unchanged, uh, corn also unchanged, and wheat up about six cents. The outside markets are a little bit lower. I think uh, the tension between U.S. and China escalated again yesterday when China uh, ordered a U.S. consulate uh, within China to be closed. Um, again, uh, some of the markets like copper, uh, stock market, uh, are lower on concern that uh, increased uh, tension between the two countries uh, could reduce uh, their uh, demand. Inside China, uh, futures for uh, corn, soy meal, palm oil, and soybean oil uh, continue to trade higher, uh, suggesting that either uh, there's concern about imports or uh, their stockpiles may be a little bit lower than what people think. There's some rumors floating around that China, uh, not, not sure of the time frame, but maybe has bought as much 17 million metric tons of corn for import. And some people think that after yesterday's export sales, both corn and new crop beans, uh, that uh, this indicates that they may be around uh, to buy more U.S. new crop corn and uh, soybeans. You know, we're competitive uh, to China versus South America. Um, our prices for corn are too high. And for wheat, um, we are competitive for hard wheat versus German prices, but we're still above uh, Russian prices. And in the wheat market, we continue to uh, go back and forth depending upon what we're trading, whether it's lower supply of Europe and Russia wheat, or if it's uh, potential for lower demand by importers due to uh, COVID. U.S. weather looks good. Uh, we've got two weeks of maybe uh, normal to below temps and maybe normal to above rains in the southern two thirds of the country with below normal rains in the northern plains. And um, there really isn't uh, any concern right now that the corn crop is gonna be hurt significantly uh, by a, a shot of hot air that lasts for a long time. There's just no high pressure ridge setting in and uh, staying for a long period of time. Uh, still, uh, soybeans are made in August, so we have to kind of watch that. Managed funds are continue to be long soybeans and soybean oil, and they continue to be short corn, uh, Chicago wheat, and soybean meal. And they feel pretty comfortable uh, in those uh, trade positions and, and relations. So again, we'll be watching weather. We'll be watching any headlines about the virus, any political issues, and uh, also money flow um, to figure out uh, where we go from now. But right now, uh, markets are in uh, corn, beans, and wheat, pretty tight trading range, and uh, don't really see a lot of uh, information today that would break us out of these uh, trading ranges. As always, these are my thoughts, and not those of ADM, ADM Investor Services. Have a safe and profitable trading day, and please treat people uh, like you would like to be treated yourself.